The following stories are generated by a neural network. It describes the content of images and is trained on romance novels. Enjoy. I've never seen a man tie her up before, so that is the reason for that. The man wore a pair of black slacks and a coat vest and tie. I didn't want to tear my eyes away from Bill. I had no idea what he meant to me. The rest of the crowd gathered around us, and for a moment, I was pretty sure she was the only person in the entire world. The flying man was barely on the ground. In fact, it felt as if he were going to jump. In fact, he had his hands on her hips, holding her close to his chest, and looking down at her as if she were the most stunning woman I'd ever seen. The man released a woman's blood, and that was the reason for all of them. They were driving quickly to the side of the truck. I let out a sharp intake of breath. I don't see no why it was such a bad idea. I had a man in control, and Kate turned her head to look at him. There was no denying it. No matter what she said. He was a shirtless man in the back of his mind, and I let out a curse as he leaned over to kiss me on the shoulder. He wanted to strangle me, considering the beautiful boy I'd become wearing his boxers. She was more than willing to rip their wedding cake out of her hands. She took a deep breath and looked back up at James, who was making love to the bride and groom. He had to act much like the leader of their group, and for the first time in months, I had no idea what she was going to do. In fact, I was pretty sure they were all bundled up in the snow. By the time I reached the end of the hall, I could see a cat in the corner of my eye. She was trying not to show that he loved the cat out there. We men were in a tense position at the end of the meeting, and I looked up at my best friend. Of course, I had no intention of letting him go. I don't know what else to say, but he was also the most beautiful man he'd ever met. 